Hi, I'm Julianne Cost. Here are four ways to select layers in a Photoshop document. First, we can use the Layers panel. Click on a layer to select it. If the layers that you want to select aren't next to one another, hold down the Command key on Mac or the Control key on Windows to select multiple non-contiguous layers. To select a range of contiguous layers, click on the first layer, then hold the Shift key and click the last layer, and Photoshop will select all of the layers in between. To quickly select all layers, excluding the background layer, use the Select menu or the keyboard shortcut Command-Option-A on Mac, Control-Alt-A on Windows. To deselect all layers, use the Select menu or Command on Mac or Control on Windows, click in an empty area of the Layers panel. The second way to quickly select layers from the image area is with the Move tool. I'll enable Auto Select in the Options bar and choose Layer or Group from the pull-down menu. Then click in the image area over the desired layer to select it. Press the Shift key to add additional layers. Shift click a selected layer to deselect it. You can also click and drag with the Move tool in the image area to select multiple layers when the Auto Select option is enabled. If you have layers that you do not want to be automatically selected, use the Layers panel in order to lock them. If you prefer to leave Auto Select disabled, pressing Command on Mac and Control on Windows will temporarily activate the Auto Select mode when the Move tool is selected. The third way, which I use most often when working with complex documents, is using the context sensitive menus. With the Move tool selected, right click or Command click on Mac on the layer in the image area and then choose it from the list. With this method, it's really helpful if you take the time to name your layers. And the fourth way to select layers is by using the keyboard shortcuts that you see on the screen, or the equivalent shortcut depending on your language and keyboard. These shortcuts are essential when recording actions because while they select layers, they do not record the specific name of the layer when recording the action. I'm Julianne Cost. Thanks for watching.